I don't know if that's ridiculously lame or the most amazing thing that I've ever heard of for a credit card. So I was checking my email over the weekend and got a very interesting looking email that said I now had a chance to apply for an Xbox Microsoft credit card. So at first I thought it was a total scam because you get these credit card scams all the time. I was like, that's ridiculous. Xbox isn't offering a credit card. Don't be silly. But I went ahead and opened up the email anyway, and it is 100% legitimate. Xbox, yes, Xbox is offering a credit card. And here is the proof in the email right here. So this is actually not for everybody. So if you got this, this lists you as an Xbox insider. You can now participate in the Xbox MasterCard preview. Well, I am an Xbox insider and I thought this is just interesting. So let's go ahead and read through this and see what they're actually saying or like the benefits of using the Xbox credit card. So the first thing is that you get to choose all of these different little Xbox designs. They're offering 5,000 card point bonus when you apply. So 5,000 points equals about 50 bucks. You get three months of Game Pass Ultimate just for applying and actually getting this card. And then like most credit cards, they have a point system. You get five times the points at Microsoft stores, three times on streaming services, three times on delivery services like DoorDash, and then the ever standard one point for everyday purchases for anything that you buy. Scroll down a little bit and they have their shop with confidence, which these are all just standard, no fee, contactless payment, free access to your FICO score. And my first thought with this is this is just ridiculous. Why is Xbox even getting into the credit card business? But as they say, curiosity killed the cat. So we're gonna actually look at this and see what these points actually do and see if they're actually something that will benefit you as a gamer. Because I personally only keep one credit card to my name, which I use for everyday things, and then I just pay it off every single month. So Xbox really has to sell me on this of why I should use their credit card and is it going to give me any actual Xbox benefits? So here it is on the actual website and it just regurgitates a lot of the same information that we saw on that email. They talk more about being able to personalize your cards and they give these examples right here, but they all only have the Xbox logo on them. Just want to say a huge thank you to all of you guys who subscribe to the channel. And if you're not subscribed, consider doing that now. And it does say choose one of five iconic designs and personalize it with your gamer tag. So you can actually get your gamer tag on your credit card. I don't know if that's ridiculously lame or the most amazing thing that I've ever heard of for a credit card. But you can absolutely do that and put your gamer tag. Now I was expecting that I would have like more game options like a Fallout card or a Halo card or honestly almost any image from the Xbox library that they would have rights to to put on your card. Again you do get three months of Game Pass Ultimate, all of your standard features which you should be getting with any card anywhere, and now we get into the fine details. Apply now and after your first purchase, earn a bonus of 5,000 points, which is equivalent to $50 in value, and three months of Game Pass Ultimate. Here's the kicker for new members. I've been a longtime Ultimate subscriber, so this actually will not apply to me. This is only going to be good for brand new subscribers that also apply and get approved for, of course, this Xbox credit card, which I think is a terrible kick in the teeth, especially if they're sending this to Xbox insiders. And actually give you a little more details about that here in the frequently asked questions. And the question is, if I used to be a Game Pass Ultimate subscriber, can I actually get this? As in, you're currently not paying for a subscription, will I actually actually get these free three months? And the answer is no, absolutely not. Game Pass Ultimate offers are valid for new members who have not had a paid subscription to Ultimate. Now, if you've only used a trial membership previously, you can get this bonus. However, if you've only ever subscribed to Game Pass Core, the old Xbox Live Gold, then yes, you are eligible for this Ultimate upgrade for free for three months. All right, so I've already had one huge downfall with this thing that I don't get the bonus, even though they're offering it to me as an Xbox insider. But let's actually let our curiosity run its course and see what we can actually use these points on. So you earn card points just like every other credit card when you charge things to your card and then you actually pay off that balance. And this is how you actually redeem points. When using your Xbox MasterCard, that is the first thing. You have to be using your MasterCard to even redeem the points. 
It expressly says to make digital purchases of single eligible items through buy or buy now at xbox.com. So for those of us that are not financially savvy, this means you have to be making a purchase with that credit card for something expressly on xbox.com that is eligible to be redeemed with these points. So that tells me that it's not everything. So no, you can't just take these points and use them anywhere. Now, a lot of credit cards do have these limitations, like you can only redeem them for miles or on certain websites. But the one credit card that I do use is an Amazon credit card, which means I can use those points for anything on Amazon. And I would say that the benefits of this card are not enough to make me personally apply for it. But if you're really curious, you can click on these links right here and look at the card terms and conditions. So is this a way to actually get more Xbox by using this card? Well, yeah, technically it is, but I personally do not like the restrictions that are on this card. But for the insanely curious, you are able to redeem your points here on their information page. It says exclusively on the Xbox store. You can redeem them for all digital games and add-ons, digital pre-orders, gift cards, and it actually says all other consumer digital goods. Which is curious to me because on the previous page it just said all eligible. And it's honestly a shame that they don't have a way for you to redeem these points straight from your Xbox because that would make things a lot simpler. I feel like they should also offer some sort of bonus that if you set this up as your default form of payment on your Xbox, that there should be some sort of bonus points or benefits for actually using their card. I would also like to see a lot more customization options other than just having the Xbox logo on my card. But overall, I feel like this is something we just don't need. It's just another credit card that's got an Xbox logo on it that you can kind of get some sort of point reward system on, which most credit cards do. But hey, if you really want to show off your hardcore Xbox device, devotion, you can apply for this credit card as an insider right now. Well, thank you guys for watching. I've been John, by the way. This here is the Xbox Basement. If you guys like these videos, do me a favor and hit that little like button down there. Thanks for watching, and we will see you in the next one. That is ridiculous. An Xbox credit card. What will they think of next?